Hi, this is Teddy, your Google Workspace and Gmail strategist. The question is this, can I have a free website? The answer is yes, and I'll show you what you can do in this video. So I'm using my Gmail account. This is my free Gmail account. It's burrisconsulting at gmail.com. It's 100% free. I'm not paying for any of it. Now, what can I do? I can go to sites. So just hit the plus when I'm logged into my account and type in site and go to Google Sites right here, sites.google.com. Now you can see I've started a Google, a, a Google site already. It's out there. It's public. It's, uh, you know, I did this in a quick little setup to be able to show people how to share a calendar on it, but it's a full-blown website. I have the ability to do lots of stuff on here. Create your own theme. I can have themes. I can insert pages. I can insert text on a page. I can add new pages if I want. I have a home page here. I can, I can add another page right down here. Hit the plus and a new menu selection, new link, a new page. So create a new page. Get this page two is, you know, my contact information. Go to advance and give it a path and just call it contact and hit done. So here's the new page. So what do I want to put on here? I want to, you know, maybe I can change the image, change the header type. I can go back to insert. You know, I can insert uh, text. I can insert uh, images. I can insert a link to a, a, a Google Doc that's on in my drive. I can embed stuff in it. You know, put a text box here and say whatever I want to do. Whatever you would do on a website, you have the ability. Uh, this is my contact information. Whatever, you know, I can format that 17 different ways from Sunday. I can make it bold, select it all, make it bold, change the text to heading one, etc., 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 and put more stuff down below, add more information. I can add images, again, another text box with images, content, and add, again, add more information on this page. And again, I can make more pages. Look, here's the home button and here's the contact button. Add another page. Go to page. Hit the plus, and I can put, you know, my portfolio. Give it a name. Hit done. And look, I put portfolio up here. So I can put more stuff down here. Again, go back to insert, and I have the ability to create a layout. I can really cool layout. I can put two images up here and put some text down below. I, whatever I put here, I'll grab an image. I'm just grabbing an image. On that image, I can put a link. So I can hit this link right here. And I can send them somewhere if I want to. Send them to another page. Hit apply. So now there's a hyperlink on that image. If I can preview this right here, I can preview it. And look, there's a hyperlink in that image I haven't put there. So come out of preview. And I can come back and keep building this website in Google Sites. Now, if I want to be more sophisticated, then what I might want to do is I might want to get a custom domain for it. I can you know, go get a custom domain. It puts it back here. Domain URLs are usually somewhere just under 20 bucks a year to have them. The first one's cheaper. Um, I can change the navigation. All kinds of things you can do in Google Sites that you can do in pretty much all other website builders, whether it's WordPress or Squarespace, et cetera, et cetera. Those might be far more sophisticated, but Google Sites has come a long way. And here I'm answering the question and reiterating this point. It's free, as long as you have a Gmail account. I'm Teddy Burris, your Google Workspace and Gmail strategist, trainer, and coach. And I hope you get value out of using Google Sites.